what they do when they come out, they shut down the neighborhood and they seize and confiscate all the privately owned security cameras and surveillance videos from the public because they don't want to be able to be disproven when they spit the official lies 24 hours later. <laughs> Get the f*** out of here. Yes! I crapped out my mouth! If the police can just pull over anybody on any bicycle that they want and decide that they're guilty without any court and then force them to snitch, just how far does that degrade our justice system and how trustworthy are any of these actors? See, police? I don't yeah. see him. What? Yes. She spotted this, these two cops down the street harassing a cyclist. It's probably serious enough for us to go intervene, right? Yeah. So I don't know where I'm going to park, but I'm going to just get you out there, okay? Don't tell me! You know, it's the truth. And, and it seems like they were trying to let me go before you come. Because you come running. And they tried to hurry up the and process? Like, yeah, that, 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 he was already by his car trying to fucking like, get in the car already. That's happened hundreds of times. But the, the person in the car never is willing to talk to me. They don't want to say anything about they're, about they're trying to get make a snitch because then pe if they, it's on camera, people will think that that person is a snitch or something, right? Right. Yeah, I mean, if I, I'm, if I didn't know you, I wouldn't. Yeah. Like, because I know you, I'm like, I'll call you, I'll call you. Like, like I'll call you, I'll let you know what happened. But at the moment, I just want to call. I don't I, I don't want to be close to them. I want to be away from them. Like, get yeah. me away. Yeah. Be like, uh, by the way, I talked to Egypt, and he told me the whole story. Yeah. And I have it on videotape. It's, it's, not, it's not good for the community to try to make people fucking snitch on, on each other. I mean, especially like... Or make things up. Yeah. Yeah. Because if you want to get out, you, uh, you want to go to jail, you're going to have to make something up. Yeah, exactly. Okay, see, I want to... Let's stop, let's stop for a minute over here, Egypt. That's the kind of an important part. Let's see. I just want to, I want to ask you about that. I'm turning some first. I'm hoping Egypt is going to make a fine photographer. He noticed this sheriff deputy sleeping in the car behind me when we were talking. And you know what they say, 10 cameras is better than one. I'll find okay. it right now. Okay. I see you pull. Okay. Hey, Tom. You? I'm doing good, thank you. Hi, right, how are you? <laughs> What's your name? Chen. Oh, Chen? Chen. 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 All right, guys, you have a good day. You, you too. too. You too. Okay, right, so um, what's your name? <laughs> okay, so he told me. He said everything's fine. He said, but he said he wants to leave. He said he's gonna call me right now. <laughs> Egypt. You're a lifesaver, bro. Well, I don't know. Maybe Laura. Laura was over there, not me. Well, this is the two guys she told me about. Yes. Okay. Yeah. When I ran up, they had already seen her. That's why they were letting you go, I think. No, the ones they see you, they saw your truck. You stopped, and then you turned around, yeah. and then you parked. Yeah. And that's when you opened the back of the door, and he's like, hey, he's like, I'm going to give you a break today, man. Come yeah. on, get out. All of a Oh, was they see you and they're like, oh, oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> this is like a bunch of bitches. 
<laughs> be, 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 <laughs> yeah, be safe, that's funny. I'm like, wow. So when these cops are telling these guys to be safe, keep in mind they have no concern over this person's safety at all. They're trying to destroy their life for a dollar, for a promotion. Deputy Chen and whatever the other name is, pressured or something like. Of course. Like you, you said to make things up. I mean, yeah, because they they tell you if you don't tell us with anything, we gotta take you to jail. Okay. They'll ask you like, who has guns? I don't hang out with people that got guns. So you don't have, you don't know the answer. Right? I don't know. Like I have guns. You know, I'm not that type. I don't hang out with those type of people. You know, oh, who burglarized cars? I don't know. Yeah. They're, they're acting like since you ride a bicycle. They, uh, like I know every, they, every crime or everybody or every criminal in the street. Like that makes you a criminal so you must know all the other criminals. Right, right. You're getting six figure salaries for ruining people's lives. I would never expect someone to give me something for nothing like you pieces of shit do every day. What happened to your other bike? Okay. You know the Infinity bike? Yeah. And then I was like, oh, it got stolen. I was at my friend's house and they left it down and, and, and it got stolen. He's like, oh, try to get the serial number and they won't keep an eye on it. Like, what right. the fuck? Yeah. Uh, like, since okay. when? But that's impossible. There's no record of stolen bicycles. There is a serial number on the bottom, but it has no significance or relevance. So they pretend to run the serial number on the bicycle, and then they're like, oh, well, you know why we're at it. We're gonna go ahead and go through your pockets, your backpack, any of your belongings. And if you so much as have an unpaid parking ticket or any failure to appear, any kind of paraphernalia. We gotta take you to jail. Regardless of the fact that it's not a jailable offense, but they will promise and insist they're good at putting people in jail and they can send you there for a long time. Yes, you magic, bro. Like, they know what's up with you, dog. Well, they got uh, badges, but you got a camera that's like more powerful than anything, bro. Fuck any bad. I don't want to find out that Egypt has been punished for possessing more integrity in his little finger than you do in your whole department 10,000 wide. I will drop everything and focus on you petty little fucks. But I don't think we want that to happen, right? I'm gonna give Egypt a camera so you recognize him as my associate. In the meantime, I suggest you bitches slow down on murdering innocent people if that's not too much to ask. In other words, quit being and keep your gun where it belongs in the holster. 